Hi everyone, welcome to your virtual Spanish class. My name is Narissa and this is the first video in this series on beginning Spanish. In this lesson, we will look at some basic Spanish greetings or los saludos. Vamos, let's go! Los saludos. The greetings in Spanish are called los saludos and first we have one which I think everyone knows and that's hola. Hola is an informal way of greeting someone and you can use it at any time of the day. It's just like saying hi or hello in English. And also you have a bit more formal greetings which you would only use at specific times of the day. So in the morning up until before lunchtime you would say buenos dias. Buenos dias, good morning. After lunch, you would say buenas tardes, which means good afternoon. Buenas tardes. And finally, when the sun is down and it's getting dark, you can say buenas noches, which means good evening or good night. Buenas noches. The formal greetings used here, buenos dias, buenas tardes, and buenas noches, can also be used in informal settings. So for example, you would say good night to your family when going to bed. So just to recap, hola, informal greeting, which can be used at any time during the day. Buenos dias in the morning, buenas tardes in the afternoon, and buenas noches in the evening or at night. So depending on the time of day you're looking at this video, write in the comments below. Buenos dias, buenas tardes, or buenas noches. And finally, I have a tiny exercise for you. In this slide, there are a few activities or verbs. Don't worry too much about verb conjugations right now, as we would cover that in a later lesson. What I want you to do is to relate each of the activities in the columns with the time of day that you think is most appropriate. So we have cenar, which means to have dinner. Desajunar, which means to have breakfast, and armorsar, which means to have lunch. So which time of day do you think best relates to each of these activities? So that brings us to the end of this first video. Be sure to practice everything that you have learned whenever you have the opportunity. Also, share this video with someone who you think may find it useful, and don't forget to subscribe so you'd always know when a new lesson is up. Adios!